my fridge is clean. Okay, well, just kidding. <laughs> Look at this. I just cleaned, I cleaned the door too, but I've already put the stuff back in. I just won't upload it. We'll see.
Okay, moment of truth, guys. I just finished the risotto. It smells impeccable. Let's see how it tastes. It's so good. It's a bit of a travesty to eat risotto with a spoon, but I'd carry it over to here, so I figured I could do it for the camera. It is so good. Oh my god. Yeah, good decision. Okay. And now I need to go back to doing everything else, but I don't even want to. I just want to sit down and eat that entire pan of risotto. Oh, yeah. Oh, crunchy. Yeah, I just cooked it. Okay, so as you can see, here is the finished product, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. This is where I'm going to wrap it up wrap it up now because I am starving um, but hopefully you had a great day and I will check with you in the next video bye guys well, good morning I'm not sure if you can tell but I am in bed I just made a coffee and I wanted to come back and talk to you guys very briefly um, Mm. Things are going to get so serious that I'm even going to put the, get the coffee down. So yesterday, I never really talked about things that I'm thankful for or things that we all have to be thankful for in the video because I was making it about sort of my the food and the gym and getting ready for Thanksgiving. And I posted it on my other social media. Um, so if you don't follow me there, definitely add me. Um, but anyway, so I wanted to just quickly come back and you know talk about that now Obviously, you don't need one day a year to be like, okay today. I'm gonna be thankful. No, you need to be thankful every day But it's a great time of year <coughs> Excuse me To sit down with your family your friends whoever is special in your life and just you know, reevaluate um, I think again, it's a time of year when I just want to reevaluate my goals and think, think about what I'm doing next and what is helping me um, get better with my life. Are there things that I should cut out? Are there things that I should add um, as I go into the winter? Because, you know, I find that winter is like my, my big building season. Um, I make jokes about bulking and everything, but it isn't just about putting on muscle, putting on body weight. And as with this whole series, it is about improvement. Um, my birthday is in, uh, well, <laughs> just over two weeks at this point and, you know, another year, another new year. So I think it's sort of everything. It's, it's Thanksgiving, it's my birthday, it's just, you know, reevaluating, reassessing and refocusing. So I'm thankful that I have my health. It's the simplest things, but it's when you are sick or unwell or something's wrong that you realize how much you should be grateful for what you have um of course my family you know i my sisters my mom my niece and nephew uh, my husband you know i'm so thankful to have them in my life they lift me up you know when you're having a bad day those are the people you turn to um you know my mom and i had a rocky <laughs> relationship in my teen years but you know, I feel like that's a rite of passage for many mother and daughters. But now, you know, my mom's the first person I call for most things, um, even down to how long to cook something. I mean, I could Google it, but that's why I have a mother. And, you know, again, we don't always see eye to eye on things. That's fine. Uh, but we have, a, you know, a respect for each other. And my mom knows me so well. And it's just great that I still have her in my life because not everyone my age still has their parents. Um, so I'm incredibly grateful that I do. I still have um, both of my grandmothers. Um, and you know, my, my grandmother will be, my one grandmother will be turning 99 on her birthday. You know, she has lived a long life. She's taught me so much and I'm so thankful that I've been able to uh, get to learn those things from her. Um, of course, my group of friends, um, I have some of the best girlfriends anyone could ever imagine having uh, they I would consider them to be my family to be honest um, these girls I don't know they just they took me in and I say that because I feel like I was a bit of the outsider coming in you know I'd moved here and uh, 
they just they accepted me and we have become really close over the years and yeah it's just it's sort of like having a bunch of sisters you know and we're all sort of doing our own different things right now um but I, I know that if i needed something and i called one of them up they would be there for me so definitely make sure that you have strong friendships because that matters um, it's very important. I mean, you know, your family's always there. You know, you don't get to pick your family, but you do get to pick your friends and, you know, make sure you've picked ones that are good for you. Um, and, you know, those are just like the, the simple things that I'm thankful for, but those are what matter in life, you know? Um, so anyway, guys, uh, if you would like, you should leave a comment below and tell me what you're thankful for. You know, um, is there anything in particular um, you know, if you'd like to share, please comment below. Um, but thank you so much for watching this video. Um, and, you know, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. As usual, uh, subscribe, um, because then it notifies you when I put out another video. But I will check chat with you guys all in the next video. Have a fantastic and blessed week. Bye.